What is up, beautiful people? Coronel Gilliams here from CLG Lifestyle. Hope you guys are feeling blessed and grateful to be alive because guess what? Some people did not wake up this morning, but we did. And that's enough of a reason, in my opinion, for us to find even a smallest opportunity to be grateful. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe wherever you're watching this video. I am on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, Twitter. All right. So some of y'all know, okay, so for those of you who don't know, I am a lifestyle influencer. CLG Lifestyle is all about influencing you to love self. I believe it's important for you to discover who you are according to God's design, uh, for you to be free ultimately from all the lies, the deceptions, the things that became a part of who you are, but really in truth was not because you didn't have a frame of reference or the knowledge to know that your identity comes from God and God alone and that you have the power to reinvent yourself when you've come into the revelation that you've been living someone else's life. Okay, so definitely uh, subscribe if this is what you're looking for. If you feel like you can benefit from a platform such as this, you definitely want to stay connected. So I wanted to encourage you, you know, those of you who have been following me, you know, I wanted to encourage you and to let you know again that um that you have the power to reinvent yourself you have the power to change your life and that um in that in order for you to do so you have to make a decision you have to make a decision to want more to be more the beautiful thing about it is that god helps you to do this you know god gives us the the light right the light in a place of darkness that opens our eyes to see that we can desire more we can want more we can be more so once you begin to receive this light once you begin to see this light working in your life don't run away from it this is god's love his wooing love his enduring love calling you and welcoming him, welcoming you into his into his family and into the life that he has for you so don't ever forget um that at the end of the day, you know, once you've, again, come into the revelation that you didn't create your own self, that there is a higher power or the highest power, and that when you stay connected to God, you know, all things work out for your good, then you know that there's nothing to worry about. And yes, there are going to be times where you're worrying. There are going to be times where you are fearful. There are going to be times where you have doubt. But all of this is training, retraining of the mind, because Again, we've come from different backgrounds, different experiences. We have different mindsets. And so once you now are introduced to something new, who you are, you know, is going to be exposed. And some of the things that are going to be exposed are things that you don't necessarily like. It may not be things that you want. It may be things that you are surprised. You know what I'm saying? That you're being that's being exposed in your life. Right. Um, but again, it's, it's not for you to have any fear or to feel like you are, um, you know, that you don't have hope or that it's impossible to change or to reinvent yourself. Once you have these revelations, it's now a decision that you need to make to say, God, I want you to help me. God, I want you to, you know, lead me in the way that I should go. God, I want what you have for me because you've given me a taste of the light and I've tasted the light and I've seen that it's good. And so give me more of that and help me to make decisions that align with your will for my life. So these are things, again, that you come to the revelation of when, again, you've made a decision to want to change your life, to want more, you know, to leave, you know, the dead things behind, to leave the things behind that you're realizing don't serve you. You now have a restlessness when it comes to the environments that you used to be in, when it comes to the people that you used to be around, when it comes to the things that you used to do. You don't want to do these things anymore, right? All of these are signs of your awakening. All of these are signs that you are being pushed into something better, something bigger, something greater. Don't resist it. Don't fight it. All right. I am Corwin L. Gilliams from CLG Lifestyle. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for your support and talk to you guys soon.